Uh, and yeah, reversing that insert mesh. We're going to do controlling curves tomorrow. Sorry about that, Lou. Um, it should just be a matter of, just really quickly, since I know you've asked this question a lot, and I want you hanging around waiting for me to get to it. So really quickly, this will be my last one. I'm going to go to Unmesh Mesh Center here. So I'm going to steal. Let's grab a zipper real quick. So I'm going to say, go to my brush, and we're going to look at la, 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 la. Where's the zipper at? There's the zipper. I'm going to hit W, and I'm going to steal this closed zipper mesh here, and I'm going to unify this so it Boy, that's way over there. What the hell? Let's unify this. Oh, I was, okay, that's my fault. Okay, so uh, this is a tri-part brush here. So if I go to brush, create insert mesh, new, go over here to stroke, curve, turn curve mode on. Now I've got my zipper here, and this is the repeating middle part. If I go and I do this, and I hit brush, create insert mesh, append, okay. Now I have another brush that reverses the direction. So if I tap this one and grab this one, there you go. So those directions are reversed. So now let's say you've already got the curve drawn out. <clears throat> let's see if this works. So for example, this we're going to get into controlling curves next time. We got a sphere, edit, uh, get out of my way. Tool, make poly mesh 3D, control shift. So we can go ahead and do like a slice curve through here. Let's do a slice curve through here too. So I'm going to take... Actually, you know what? Let's do this. A little sneak peek for you guys. Make polymesh 3D. W. Stretch this out here. And actually, you know what? Let's go to geometry, edge loops. Let's go ahead and delete these loops. Let's go ahead and go into insert multiple edge loops. I'm going to give this some resolution. And then now, if I go in here to brush uh, deformations, we'll do a bend curve and we'll change that axis here. So now we can use this as like a control curve for our path. And then I'm going to hit control W and then we're going to say, let's do a quick group by normals. Isolate this one here, delete hidden. If I want to steal this path, I can do poly group, poly loop here and here. Isolate this, delete hidden. We're going to do a stroke, curve functions, poly group. So we've got our border here. So now if I want to put a zipper along this path, I can go to my insert mesh brush and I can tap it. And let's make this bigger. There we go. So now we've got our zipper. It's like, oh, I want to reverse the direction. Just grab your other zipper, um, tap that curve, and there it is, reversed. Cool.